Good evening and welcome to Just Event Online News at 9. A renowned academic and former acting rector of the Federal Polytechnic offer, Dr. Olorongbe Afalabi, has said more local government is ripe for key social cultural amenities such as its own radio station, more development fund among other vital social cultural infrastructure. Dr. Afolabi made us known on Saturday during the maiden summit of Moro Descendant Development Union, stressing that the amenities will enhance the council's growth and development. How much is it going to cost? If the coverage at the initial stage only wide much, but later that one will expand. There is a bunny radio station for Bolt and so here. But I think that's here. I want to say program. I don't need it. Only, only pet. I don't know that. That one. How much do we need? How do we realize it? Speaking with the newsman, the organization publicity chairman, Chief Ahmed Adio, said the gathering was to promote unity and togetherness in the local government. Hello. Looking at you know the you know has in terms of you know mineral you know deposits, chapter eight of this program you know resources. She wants to show me as well my role in the treasure of Moros and as a local government area in 1970. There is no unity. This cannot be achieved. So that's the essence of the summit. On his part, former car commissioners for work and transport, engineer Slyman Rotimi Ilyasu, posited that their gathering is to forge a united Moro, driving by shared vision for development. We are not the chapter of freedom. Into action. And we are chapter of freedom. And you must guide you So it is very important. It will have a meeting and we time for a cash shake. About that is the development of more. I share. I, mean, I can. I mean, I've heard what our fathers are saying, hey. but I believe more. Don't you stop me now. You are the only one that can stop yourself. Hey. Nobody can stop you. So if anything is stopping us in more, hey. we need hey. more that are not together. It is when we are together when we back and now. Voice. Hey. Hey. We are In his contribution, an honorable commissioner for special duties. Hmm. John Alarawaju encouraged the organizers to keep up the good work while pledging support for their future initiatives. Today, Moro local government was created in 1970. Precisely for Only none of these districts had any health facilities which could take to care today, you can describe Moro can best be described as an underdeveloped local government in Nigeria. And, uh, yes, sir. Okay. With so, no one pay to see socially educationally. Go, go, area one more, more ah, new hospital. Government. And you can see that ah, maybe uh, you call it this and anything. It's more cafe, very nipe, more roche, wale, nigga. I will believe a job hospital, me, no, and you. And ask ourselves questions. A job, me, be one, you. What has happened? Because, have Jerry, I just have to look out. Then, or Roma, they should pay or Roma, but they or Roma, but they need a new. They create the nigga, or to pay low. We have a population that don't have access to the population. They should have a new district, they should have a new district, they should have I mean, a local government can call. We have schools. We have secondary schools. We have secondary schools. We have teachers, but teachers don't. We have water. 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 Darul Ulum Alumni Association, in collaboration with Marka's alumni, hosted a grand reception ceremony to celebrate. Professor Abubakar Abdul Malik's promotion to professorship. Professor Abdul Malik, the first teacher and principal of Darul Ulum, 
was held for his enduring contributions to education and provoked our role in shaping students' future. The alumni in their commendation hailed Professor Amalik's remarkable achievement while appreciating his dedication. Secretary General of the Ulum Alumni Organization, Dr. Ridwanullah Olagoju, noted that the program highlighted deep respect and admiration for the professor within the educational community. Well, it is uh, to show that the reward of teachers is not only in the heaven. And even while we are here on the surface of the earth, teachers are to be recognized, are to be honored. Today, we are honoring the very first teacher in this citadel of Arabic and Islamic learning. What am I talking about? I'm talking about the very first teacher who taught here in Darul Ulum. The moment Darul Ulum was established in the far back 1963. Darul Ulum was established due to very impressive initiative of the ninth Emir of Ilorin, the person of late uh, Al Haj. He noticed then that the impressive level of Arabic and Islamic learning was becoming dwindled. He wanted to revitalize, to rejuvenate this level of Arabic and Islamic teaching in the learning. And he consulted with the imams and scholars in his state. Dr. Muhyiddin Abu Bakr, the Salban's other son, described his father as a pace setter while commending Darul Ulum alumni for their lifetime honor. Um, I think it is a, a great pleasure and uh, an honor to be here to see how the good people of Elori uh, express their gratitude to someone they love. And I'm fortunate to be the son of that person that they express their love to. It's a great honor to you and it's a great honor to his father. Uh, that uh, for the short stay and the little he has contributed to the development of knowledge, Islamic knowledge in this community, many years beyond six decades after, he still been remembered and honored. We thank the people of Elori, we thank the graduates, the alumni of. Uh, the markers and all those who have contributed and thought it fit to honor this gentleman. I'm sure when he was here, he never thought a day like this would come and he never thought he would be so appreciated. So the glory is to Allah for this mercy he has done unto him. Yes, so much that to say, but the legacy has already been established here, and uh, we can only thank God for the legacy that has been done here. For us as uh, a family, um, Baba is a, is a pioneer, is a best center. Uh, the uh, this is because uh, our teacher and mentor, now today Professor Abdulmalik, was the first teacher who was sent to us from Agege to start that alone. Today, many of us have become professors before he became. Many of us have become imams and uh, judges and lawyers and so on. 
just laying the foundation, lay, you know, laying on the foundation he has built for us. By the time he retired, he continued teaching at Montanfo University, and the university saw him and that sincerity, that seriousness in the academics, and was awarded professorship. He felt that his professorship is unique, is special, and we must honor him. And we thank God that he was not given professorship for some Muslim. He is given professorship when he is alive. So what, what we are doing today, we don't want to do it after him. We want to do it when he is alive to see how much how much we appreciate. The event was attended by Chief Imam of Ilorin, Imam Imali of Ilorin, among other dignitaries. The Aquara Progressive Caucus has demonstrated its commitment to strengthening the All Progressive Congress in the state by distributing campaign materials to chairmanship candidates ahead of the upcoming local government elections. Speaking during the distribution, KPC State Chairman Tunde Yusuf said the group had earlier inaugurated campaign committee that will go to nooks and crannies of the state to propagate the gospel of good governance. He said the campaign materials will go a long way to help the candidates. Governance of the can go on and see review or election for Siri Nimba in 2023 can be time. So we said the governor was shaking the yega oti muno wa doti o kawa fi bale that he pay buba mo mebe wa pata ni no bukan su ti adi pe wa wole bo ni ma sele ni ba mi te bi yen ati ole te ba jonja so te yen ati ole te ba jo mu jakadi o le wa so pe ah ile lo yo mi ile to yo mi ohun lo ju ori mi gbe mole lo ju se kini kan ma ba ka ri wi si e ko ma ba waye iye ni governor fi wa so pe a gogo a godo je kara aduma e pe agbara ji gogo eleyi ti so fe ni ata nkan kaiki ati kan pe ta n wo jule so jule kaiki ta n se kaiki local government yi ke se pe o kaka o ga wa ti sise kale ama tun fe je ka won ara ni boye lo mi te se gbe lo ni ko ma gbe eyan ti governor wa to je ati kan to ti se the caucus also congratulated Governor Abraman Abdurazak on his confirmation of the prestigious Sadaun Angeri title. The distribution of campaign materials and celebration of the governor's honor underscored the caucus's dedication to promoting unity and success within the APC. Oh, yeah. Amen. 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 